Hello and welcome to DTW Test Prep Welcome. Okay, so we have a SATMAP problem here and it's on exponents. All right, so look at this here. It says 2 raised to the power of x plus 3 minus 2 raised to the power of x plus equal to k in parentheses 2 raised to the power of x. So we have to find the value of k. Okay, don't be scared about this question. All right, all it needs is your knowledge of um, exponents, your rules. Um, your knowledge of um, simplifying, grouping, factoring. That's what it needs here. Okay, so let's quickly do, we can do this together. So here, you, we have here 2x plus 3 minus 2 raised to the power x equal to k, in parentheses, 2 raised to the power x here. We can simplify this, we can break it down because now we are trying to cancel out this x because we are looking for k. So we have to cancel out one variable. All right, so here, this is likened to, remember, when you have something like this and it's plus, it means the same base, it's 2x times 2 raised to the power 3. Okay, this same thing is this. We, we are going backwards now, all right, to the laws of exponents. So this is this, then minus 2 raised to the power x equal to k in parentheses 2x raised to the power x. From here, we can factor out 2 raised to the power x because it's here, it's here. So I'm going to factor it factor it out. So I'm left here with 2 raised to the power 3 minus 1. Okay, we factored out. When you multiply, you get the same thing here. So this will give us k in, in parentheses 2 raised to the power x. From here, we have 2 raised to the power x here, 2 raised to the power x here. We can cancel out. Okay, because what is binding this two here is multiplication, and also here is multiplication, so we can cancel this this guy out. So what are we left with? We left it uh, two raised to the power three minus one equal to k. So from here we can solve. All right, so two raised to the power three is eight minus one equal to k, and what is eight minus one? That's seven. So seven is what equal to k, or k is equal to seven. All right, so that's the value of k, and our answer here is b. Okay, do you see how easy it is? So you don't need to get, you know, worried and scared about this kind of maths. All right. So thank you for staying tuned to the end of this video. Please do make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and share with your friends, family, and loved ones trying to prepare for the SAT exams. Okay, you can join our Facebook group. You can drop a picture of any math problem. All right, on the group. The link to the group is in the video description box of this video and you get your solutions, okay? Interested in online tutoring, please do contact me, all right? And you can check our website for other further resources. All right, thank you so much from DTW Test Prep. Finally, don't forget that Jesus Christ is coming soon. Please do give your life to Christ for he's the way, he's the truth, and he's the life. He's the one who's going to lead us to heaven at last and give us peace here on earth and joy and love and health and wealth and prosperity he will give us it's in jesus okay he would give us all right he has already even given us when you just just accept him as your lord and personal savior all right and he's going to take all your body all your yokes and he will give you that which is light and beautiful all right and graceful that's what he's going to give you all right thank you and see you in our next video you are destined to win in your forthcoming sat exams and also in life take care